How's everyone doing? I'm back here again for a new video, and in this video I am doing a new Blu-ray review. It's been a while since I've done a Blu-ray review, but I wanted to do one for this one because I am very, very happy that this film has finally come to Blu-ray, and the Blu-ray that I'm going to be reviewing today is the Blu-ray for My Girl 2. Uh, yes, My Girl 2 is now available finally on Blu-ray. I am so happy that this movie finally got a Blu-ray release. I was so happy when the first My Girl movie uh, was released on Blu-ray because My Girl is one of my all-time favorite movies. It's one of my favorite childhood movies. It's a movie that I grew up watching, and I was so happy when it finally got a Blu-ray release a few years back. And I've been hoping that My Girl 2 would also get a Blu-ray release because I think My Girl 2 is a really great sequel. You know, I loved um, seeing Veda you know, uh, learning a, you know, learning things about her mom, and I just thought that My Girl 2 was an all-around great sequel, and I was hoping it would get a Blu-ray release, and it finally did. Now, when they first announced that My Girl 2 was coming to Blu-ray, they also announced that the first My Girl was coming to Blu-ray, which I thought was kind of weird because they already released My Girl on Blu-ray. You know, I did a review of it, and it was a really great uh, Blu-ray release. Um, I did comment on the uh, the post from Sony on their Facebook asking, oh, it's weird that my the first My Girl was getting a new Blu-ray release since it's already available on Blu-ray. And somebody commented saying that there was something wrong with it. Um, I don't know why, um, uh, you know, because like I said, the first My Girl, you know, it had a great Blu-ray release. You know, the transfer was great, sound was great, it had good special features. So I really don't know the difference between the new Blu-ray of My Girl and the one the, that I have, the one that was released a few years back. So if anybody does know, let me know down in the comments below. Uh, but yeah, guys, I am just very, very happy that My Girl 2 has finally come to Blu-ray. And uh, yeah, in this video, I'm going to let you guys know what I think about the uh, Blu-ray. Now, I've already done a uh, review of the actual movie, so if you guys want to see that, I'll leave a link down below. It is an older video, um, but... You know, I do really enjoy My Girl 2. I think it's a great sequel, um, you know, and, um, yeah, like I said, I'm just um, really happy that this is now on Blu-ray. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to talk about what I like about the Blu-ray, and then I'm going to talk about what I don't like about it. Now, what I do like about it is I do think that the movie looks pretty good. You know, I think that they, they cleaned it up well. It looks better than the DVD, I think. Um, you know, the, the picture looks nice. And also the sound quality on it looks nice as well. I think they, um, you know, the sound looks really, sounds really nice, really clear. So overall, I do think that this movie has a, uh, a really good transfer and, um, a really good, uh, really good sound. Um, now the, uh, the bad things about this Blu-ray is it is bare bones. Um, there's no special features, which I can kind of understand because the first My Girl movie is the one that everybody remembers. And so I understand why they put features on, you know, the uh, the first My Girl Blu-ray. You know, it had a commentary track, and it also had some behind-the-scenes footage. And I understand that, you, you know, that they weren't going to put any features on My Girl. I understand that. I do kind of wish that they at least had maybe some footage from, like, on the set. Because on the, uh, the first My Girl Blu-ray, you know, it did have footage of you know, um, Anna Klomsky, you know, Macaulay Culkin and all of them on the set of the movie, and there were interviews, um, on set, so, and I kind of wish that they would have included that, um, so there are no special features, which is, you know, kind of disappointing, but also, I understand why, because, you know, a lot of people remember the first My Girl movie, and they don't remember My Girl 2 as much, and so obviously the first My Girl is going to be the better seller, you know, so I understand why, but, the thing is, is that they did the bare minimum with this Blu-ray. Now, yes, the the transfer looks good and the um, the audio looks good, but they didn't even the the menu of this Blu-ray doesn't even have a scene selection. Yeah, there's like when when you go onto the menu, it's just an image of um, Anna Klumsky and Austin O'Brien, and it just says play or setup. There isn't even a scene selection. Which I thought was kind of like, really? Um, you couldn't have put a scene selection on the Blu-ray? I mean, come on, Sony. Um, so that's a bit of a disappointment. Um, now, something else uh, is that it is a A, B, and C um, region, so it will play in region A, region B, and region C players, which is nice. Um, I'll go ahead and open it up and show you guys the disc, because even the disc is... 
Yeah, it's just a plain white disc. So that's kind of... That's disappointed as well. Um, I wasn't expecting him to have any artwork, but, you know, still, though, just a plain white disc. Um, so, yeah, guys, so overall, I mean, it, it's good if you want to see a, a nice transfer of the movie with good sound, um, you know, but it is definitely lacking as far as special features or anything else. Um, the only thing you can really do is, you know, put subtitles to it. I mean, like I said, the Blu-ray doesn't even have a scene selection. So, it's definitely not, you know, it's not, you know, a great Blu-ray release, but it does have a good transfer and a good, um, and good sound. So, if you do want to see this movie with a great, you know, a nice transfer and, uh, you know, good sound, I would definitely recommend picking it up. Um, just don't expect, you know, any features or anything. Um, now, I just finished watching the movie just for me to do this review because I wanted to look, check out the transfer and, you know, when I was watching it, I really, you know, it reminded me of how great this this movie is, how great of a sequel it is, and I really wish that more people um, have seen it um, because I know everybody remembers the original movie, and I'm sure a lot of people probably didn't see the second one because the first movie. I'm not going to go into what happens in the first one, but I just know that My Girl 2 is definitely an overlooked movie. I think. And um, I really do think it's a movie that, that people should check out. I really think it's a great sequel. And I am glad that it's finally come to Blu-ray. Even if it is lacking in some places, it is still a nice Blu-ray. And um, I'm really happy to finally have it. So, anyway guys, thank you guys so much for watching. Like I said, I'm very happy that My Girl 2 has finally come to Blu-ray. And I wanted to do this video just to let you guys know that the Blu-ray is out. Now, um, I it was delayed. Um, it was supposed to be out in April, I think, and I pre-ordered it at the beginning of April, and then it got delayed till um, today, I think. I think it just got released today. Um, it is available on Amazon, and I'm sure it's available on other sites as well, so I would definitely recommend picking it up. Um, so yeah, guys, thanks for watching. Like I said, if you guys know anything about the new My Girl Blu-ray, and if there's a difference between this one and the older one, let me know in the comments. And let me know if you are planning on picking up My Girl 2 on Blu-ray, um, you know, because, you know, I do think it's a really great, great movie, and I'm really happy it's now on Blu-ray. And let me know down below what you think of My Girl 2. And also, if you guys want to hear what I think about My Girl 2, I'll leave a link in the description box um, about to my review of My Girl 2. Anyway, guys, thanks everybody for watching. My next video will be my Wizard of Oz collection. I know a lot of people have been waiting on that and been asking me to do it. So I will be doing it in my next video and I should have that up by at least Monday. But anyway guys, thanks everybody for watching and I hope you all have a great weekend.